Greetings, everybody. Welcome to another video on my channel. So in this video, um, I am going to do a little bit of a different video that I've been wanting to do for a while. Um, and that's to do eBay hunting. Pretty much show you guys how I find and score some of my rare iOS devices um, that, um, that I've shared on my channel and that I've collected over this year, pretty much, since now it's officially December of 2023, um, and I've been really improving my Apple collection since I'm the very, the very beginning of this calendar year, um, of my rare Apple collection. Um, I'm going to focus on newer devices next year, in gaming stuff, but, um, in kind of more speed iOS 17 comparisons and stuff like that, um, but since my... I mean, almost pretty much have all the rare devices that I need. So there are just a few above and beyond things that I would like, but I pretty much have all the general um, requirements that I've made for myself at the, the Yama beginning of this year, or really like March, April, and May. Um, so um, that I've um, made for myself, maybe June a little bit as well, but um, pretty much... Um, so pretty much what I do is so I have all, all my watched items, right? So there's a few sealed 4Ss that I'm looking at because, um, yeah, because I do want to buy a sealed iPhone 4S and unbox it on this channel. And then some other stuff that I need, right? Um, I'm looking at 13 Pros because I don't have a 13 Pro. Um, and some other rare above and beyond stuff. Um, and yeah, right? But pretty much so, um... But pretty much, so say you're looking for, so let's see, so here's what I do. So let's say, first of all, I'll search like iPhone Rare, right? So, so, and then pretty much what I'll do is, so it will show some listings, right? Um, and there will be some, some rare stuff, like right away you'll see there's, um, so, um, an iPhone 4S for Flappy Bird, there's, ooh, an iPhone 5S, this is new, this is a, um, a gold iPhone 5S on iOS 7.1, so only $55, that's actually a rare one, because I've actually struggled to find, um, gold 5S's, I do have an iPhone 5S in gold now, on that exact version, 7.1, but I've actually really struggled, and I, I feel like I've overpaid now because I paid um a buck fifty for it. So you know I'm can go in on a nice description. It's currently geobroken. Um there are some tweaks and so that's okay. Um yeah, right. Um I think I may have bought him from the seller before, I don't fully know. Um let's see. Um not fully sure. But man, that's actually a rare one. Yeah, that's a steal because I've struggled to find gold iPhone five S still on iOS 7, so, um, and then there's an iPhone 6S Plus, so that's pretty cool, although it's pretty pricey, 400, um, but it, it's a 6S Plus on iOS 9.1, which is an early version of iOS 9, so, um, so that's really cool, although it's pricey, um, there's an iPhone 8 on iOS 12, so that's pretty rare, even though they originally shipped to iOS 11, but 12.1, so, yeah, I'm an iPhone 4S on iOS 5. That's super rare. Although, you gotta be careful because some of these can be downgraded. Um, I would contact the seller first with the iPhone 4s and 4Ss to make sure that they're not downgraded. Because um, I bought a few from the seller in the past. And um, they showed the iOS 7 logo and it exported the iOS 4 or 5. So, so um so I'll be careful and make sure that these are not downgraded. Um, but there's an iOS 5 iPhone 4, which is pretty rare if it's not downgraded. Um, there's an iOS 4 iPhone 4. It's probably 4.3.5. So probably downgraded. I would be careful. But again, if you don't really care that it's downgraded, that can be a pretty good deal. I mean, $60. The thing is, that seller does downgrade them. So that's the problem. Um, there, there's a brand new $1,000 um, iPhone 4, right, so, it's guaranteed sealed, still on iOS 4, it's a white one, which is pretty cool, I struggled to find a white iPhone 4 on iOS 4, um, 
a 6 on iOS 9, that's a good deal, 160. Um, 7 on iOS 11, right, is a good deal. 5S, 32 gig on 8.2, that's pretty rare. I have the 32 gig 5S, I believe. No, 64 gig 5S on iOS 8. Um, there's a 4S. Are you smoking Timmy? On iOS 7, so that's obviously not a good deal. Um, a 4S, iOS 6, probably downgraded though. This is a steal of a deal. $234 for an iPhone 5 on iOS 6. 6 iPhone dot free, so that's actually a really good deal. Um, Jet Black 7 Pluses. Jet Black ones are kind of rare, and I have two, so. Um, oof, someone wants 30000 Smoking crack for an original, are you kidding me? Um, um, someone wants 500 for a Twitter iPhone because they changed this freaking icon, are you kidding me? Um, um, hmm. There's a $300 5C still on iOS 7. Um, I've seen a lot from this seller. Um, 9.3.2 success, are you kidding me? 300 for a freaking, there's a scam right here. Literally, this is Robbie. Um, this guy wants 300 for an iOS 9 iPhone 6S that was on iOS 6. I guess they restored it. Um, but it still has the old wallpaper. Oh, man. Here's a 5S 500. White one. $500. Are you kidding me? Yeah, all right. For a silver. Um, there's that $50 Joe Rogan white one on iOS 7. Um, and then this stuff is good. Um, alright, this one might actually be good. Rare 1.0. Um, first gen. Pry downgrade, but it's not like you can really tell, so. Um, unlike the 4 or 4S, so. Um. So, that's actually a really good deal. There are some Flappy Bird ones, right? Um. Some other ones, um. Here's a 5C on 7.0.6, um, which can be rare, but they're um, 250, so. Um, 5C on iOS 8, I guess that's pretty rare. 6.05, 32 gig. Uh, that's pretty rare. I think that's definitely worth 550. So if you have the money, that's a good one. Um, And yeah, so pretty much, oh my god, someone wants almost 10 grand for a demo iPhone for, wow, this is cool. I haven't seen this one. Um, this is, um, wow. It looks like it's the CDMA model because it um, doesn't have the um, antenna lands up there, but it has out iOS 4. So this is probably like 4.2 out 5 or 4.2 out 6. Um, demo edition, wow. All right, A1349, so that's the Verizon one. Um, but $100, um, for an iOS 6, I don't think that's really rare, because if it was a 4S maybe, but for an iOS 6 isn't really that rare, so, um, now here, you gotta be careful, you really gotta contact the seller, because, or kind of do your own information, um, because I was about to buy this iPhone, I actually was about to buy it thinking it was going to be on iOS 4.0.1 because based on looking up the serial number in IMEI um, it showed there was man I manufactured late July um, of, of 2010 when iOS 4.0.1 was the latest but when I asked on the seller for pictures you can see right here once you get in it looks brand new it looks like it's never been touched or anything it even has the accessories but you can see that's iOS 7. So clearly this has been tampered with. So um, on the seller probably just opened it to restore it and then never used it. Um, and then you get some other. So you got to be careful. There's another iOS 4, iPhone 4. Could be downgrade. Um, probably 4, 3, 5 it looks like again. Definitely newer iOS 4. Um, and... Some other cool rare stuff. So that's one way you can look. There's another thousand dollar white four and four. Um, so some other cool stuff. There's you gotta be careful because this China guy. I'm a bit skeptical, but two point oh three G. Um, 
So that's kind of looking at iPhones now. Now, if you're looking for a specific iPhone, so so yeah, what's pretty much what I do is to so say I'm looking for an iPhone four, right? Um, pretty much what my filters are is I go to newly listed, right? And then if you want to search the price, right? Um, so like you see, here's the. Yeah, right. So there's one right there on iOS 4.3.5. There's a 4 and 6.0.1. There's a 4S on 5.1.1. That's pretty cool. Um, I know that seller very well. Um, or I buy a lot of stuff from him. So um, sometimes I'll message him and help me find um, them for me. Um, if I'm struggling to find them in whole, usually dig them out for me if I'm really struggling. So, um, But then I'll go to model so yeah we want to keep it iphone 4 and and um and then there you go iphone 4 32 gig six dollar dot one that's actually pretty decent um and um there you go um And, um, and a 32 gig, so, pretty cool, um, on, downgraded the iOS 4, so, at least the seller definitely, um, is specifying that it's downgraded, so, it says, running 4.3.5 for you with downgrade day, I figured, this iPhone 4 was running iOS 7, but it's a tethered, or untethered downgrade. So, yeah, so you gotta be careful. Um, but you kind of see, right? Um, and and I'm, then you kind of pick them out. Like, most of them are going to be iOS um, 7. There's one right here. This one looks like iOS 4, but you gotta be careful because this one definitely looks downgraded too because you know why? That battery icon is iOS 7, not iOS 4 through 6. So, you can see... Um, um, probably that one too. Um, but if you search, right, um, so there's an iOS 5 one, right? So that's a good deal. Um, probably that one. This one might be iOS 4. There we go. All right, now that's iOS 7. That was just a stock photo. Um, but... There's another iOS 5 one. We know it's not been downgraded because it's 5.0.1. This seller I bought from in the past, too. And this seller has helped me um, um, dig out rare ones, too. This guy actually helped me find the 5S. Um, um, on iOS 7. There's another iOS 4 one. Looks like iOS 4.3.5 for sure. Um probably downgrade again um yeah so you better be really careful um this one's a brand new one there we go um a cma one so that's pretty cool um, that, that one's probably on, um, and, um, pretty much, um, I just gotta reposition because my back is kind of killing me, um, but, so that's pretty much, um, iPhones, I use iOS 4 for an example, so what if I were to search, um, iPhone 4, iOS 4, Right, what well, will come up? Um, ah, there's one. This one says it's um, yeah, right. iOS um, four point three point three. So from that same seller, um, iPhone four sixteen gig black. iOS four out three out three. Um, you can see the seller.
definitely looks um, in a little rough shape. It looks like there's a few bright spots, but but yeah, this seller is honest. Um, yeah, doesn't say it's downgrade. Uh, this iPhone has not been downgrade. Yeah, so um, so that's a good deal. One twenty five is a really good deal for an iPhone four running iOS four. So um, and um, so that's a good example. Um, get a few other downgrade ones, right? But we did find a non-downgrade one on 4.3.3. So, um, don't be fooled here. I've seen this one. This is a, um, it says boxed, but it's really used in iOS 7. So, not really special. Um, So, there's that one. Let's do one more iPhone example. Um, so, let's do iPhone 5 quickly. Let's see how many iOS um, 6 iPhone 5s there are, right? Um, so, you see, you got a lot of stock photos, right? There is one. This is a steal of a deal. Oh, oops. Never mind. It's not. It's not um, a dual boot iOS 6. Never mind. Um, yeah, no, it's zero, and this is really running iOS 10, and it's dual booted, so, not a good deal, um, I get ahead there, um, this I'm a bit skeptical of, but, so it's stock iOS 6, but it's that Japanese guy, or that Chinese guy, so, I'll trust him, um, So, a little bit harder to find, but, um, let's just say, yeah, maybe like 6.1.4 or something, or rare, right? Um, so there's a few there, although I'd be skeptical, right? Um, mm, really gotta dig them out, but they're definitely out there, um. Yeah, so yeah, the only non dual one is this 6.0 one, so. Oh, wow. Um, a 10S on I was, um... 12. That one seems cool. Um, we already have one of those. But, there you go. Um, maybe if I actually went to, um, filter, went to, this would help if I actually went to model iPhone 5, right? Um, that would probably help. And if I also minimize to, I'm location US, so that'll help big time. So now here's um, some sealed iOS 6 iPhone 5s for 650. Um, 7,000. Are you smoking, Timmy? Um, 550. Um, there's one for 1,000, right? Um, open box. Um, so definitely rare, not easy to find. I've only seen some very expensive 
iOS 5 is on iOS 6. And only one non-downgrade iPhone 4, iOS 4. One 4S on iOS 5. So, um... Let's look at some iPads. So, let's go to iPad Rare. Um, so, if I search iPad Rare, so already we do have a um, iPad 3rd Gen on iOS 6, which is super rare, although they originally shipped with iOS 5. So, um, but still not bad. Oh, there's a 2nd Gen 2500. You kidding me? Um, probably iOS 4, maybe iOS 5. Um, May 4, probably iOS 9, overpriced, of course. Not nearly as many results as iPhone. This is all really you get. But, if you really search, so say if I try to search, like, iPad 2. So say I'm looking for an iPad 2 running iOS 4. Or you are. Um, so iPad 2nd Gen, um... They're out there. I mean, yeah, most of them, most likely it's going to be on iOS 9. But if you look hard, if you really look, um, there's one on iOS 7, maybe. Um, no, I think that's iOS 9. So, the wallpaper was iOS 7. Um, um iPad 2 iOS 4. Let's search. Um, I I know that seller probably has one. Um, let's say 4.3.5, right? Um, and unlike the iPhone 4, there's one, right? So there's an iPad 2, 32 gig. Um, 4.3.5, so, there you go. So, sometimes you gotta just search those extra keywords, so, iPad 2, iOS 4.3.5 will come up. Hey, there's an iPad 2nd Gen on iOS 7, so, 7.4, so, there we go. Um, so sometimes if you search those, more rare ones will come up. There's another one on iOS 7, um... Ah, oh, no way. Is this iOS 4? No way. No way. I'm a bit skeptical, but... Man, a white iPad 2 on iOS 4. Imagine. I'm a bit skeptical. Um... If it's actually, um, oh, it says iOS 4 in the description upgradable to iOS 9, but I'd be very skeptical because this looks like a stock photo, so it could potentially, um, be iOS 9, but you never know. You would definitely want to message the seller there to make sure, but I've gotten scam like that before. Um, hey, there's another one. Um, I've had two 4.3.3, a little bit more priced, but. Still good. The one I have is, is like, we 4.3.2, so, um. Let's see. And, um, there's one on, another one on 4.3.3, there you go. This one looks like, um, iOS 6. Looks like it's Jerobin, so that can be pretty cool. Um, let's just search for one more iPad. I, iPad 4, right? Um, iOS 6, right? These are easily going to come up for that seller. Um, look at this, right? Um, $315, really good deal. An iPad 4 running iOS 6, and an iPod Touch 5 running iOS 6. So, totally no dual boots, no downgrades. And look at this. That is a steal of a deal. Um, So, like 6.0.3, right, or 6.0.2, 
so six out one something like that they'll come up so get and so iPad 4 maybe if we actually change settings to iPad 4th gen model is the um iPad 4. Alright, you got a refurbished one. Um that's a good deal. Maybe iOS 6, you never know. Um I know they're gonna come up, right? Uh -huh. There's a steel one guaranteed iOS 6. I know this seller too. Um, he showed that one. Um, another steel one. Um, so they're definitely out there. Let's just search maybe 6.1.2, see what comes up. Um, oh, there's one on 6.1.1. So, alright, we're at buck 55. Pretty good deal. Um, again, most of these going to be iOS 10, but that one might be iOS 9. But again, if you're unsure, I would always message the seller too and make sure um, they can specify which iOS or at least show a picture at the about page or home screen. So it's easy to tell if you're guaranteed not sure. But that's what I do, but now let's just use some iPod Touches, so let's look for an iPod Touch 4, um, running iOS 4, um, iOS 4, there we go, ah, there's one right here, it is sealed, um, but there is one, 32 gig, specified, so there we go, it cannot run modern software, but um, should be guaranteed iOS for y'all. Um, most of these are gonna be running six out, not six. But ah, there you go. There's a fourth gen four out two out one. Um, I actually might be watching this one actually right now. Um, yeah, I already have multiple of these, but I, I could buy another one. We'll see. Um, there's another one right there too. Um, so, so yeah, they're pretty solid to find. Fifth gens on iOS six are a little bit harder. Um, there's a fifth gen on iOS eight, which is not really rare at all. Um, fifth gen on seven, oh, that's kind of rare. Um, sixth gen on nine, that's super rare. And iOS 8 is harder than ever, too. Um, took me forever to find one on iOS 8. Um, what about a second gen? Um, no, a first gen on iOS... No, a second gen on iOS 2. Um, so, there's one sealed. So, let's try... No, that's iOS 3 because of the voice icon. That one's iOS 4. Um... Alright, this one's probably iOS 2. Um, just open boxed. Um, Alright, this one's iOS 2 for sure. No question. So, again, if you really look long and hard, it takes time. Like, this video is about a half hour. And I've already found at least one of what um, I've searched for. So, um... Let's just do one more, and I think I'm going to end this video. Um, let's do... Let's do another iPhone. Let's do... Um, this is going to be fun. Um, an iPhone 7. Yeah. Um, no, yeah, let's do... Um, let's do a 3GS iOS 3, that's going to be fun. Um, iPhone 3GS, iOS 3, that's going to be fun. Right away, iOS 6, of course. 
They're easy to find on iOS 4 and 5, but not iOS 3. Ah, here's one that could be, um... Yeah, it's definitely iOS 4, but it is a free GS, so... $8.44, I'm pretty sure that's a steal. I've forgotten a lot of these for this low. Um, and they think it's iCloud locked, but it's really not. It just has to be stuck with iTunes. This is iOS 4, so which is pretty rare still, but... Um, there is one on iOS 4. Um, there's another one. That's actually a regular free G. Can't be fooled, you gotta make sure it's a free GS. There are probably some steel ones. Um, there was a refurbish. Um, There's another one. Down on iOS 4. Um, there's another one on iOS 4. There we go. 4.3.5. Alright, so it's easy to find iOS 4 for EGS. iOS 3 is a lot harder. It's probably iOS 5, it looks like. Um, Man, there's another iOS 4 when this one's cracked, but definitely iOS 4. Um, oh, wow. No way. There's a white one. This is also iOS 4, brand new. So, um, so they're easy to find on iOS 4. This is 4.1, I think. Um, the, um, because of the older icon, but as Game Center, so that's how we know. That's how I was able to tell with the iPhone 4 when I was looking for one. Um, yeah, I was free, free Jesses. I have three of them. Um, they're, they're hard to come by. What, very grand? Are you kidding me? Um, Right, yeah, no, this is iOS 6, but it is, it does have some rare apps, though. But are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't know how they expect someone's going to pay 30000 for one of those. Um, brand new iOS 4. Um, 32 gig, though. That's pretty cool. Another free GS iOS 4. Um, here's one on iOS 3. This is iOS 3. There you go. About $500 though. So. But. This is iOS 3. Um. The, uh, there you go. Oh, this is a free G though, not a free GS. Whoops. Nope. There's a free G. Um, and also, if it was a free GS, you would have a compass app there. So, my bad. Gotta really pay attention to detail there. So, um, this one's a free G. Probably, no, it could be resealed. But, alright, this one's a free GS. Looks like it's resealed, you can tell. Um, Damn. Yeah, right. Free GSs on iOS 3 are really hard to find. Just like, um... iPad first gen on iOS 3. They're really hard to come by. I really had a lot of trouble finding both. Um... Well, my 3.0 free GS, my first one, right? That one I found easily back in 2017 when I was 15, right? Um, I was, um,
Yeah, um, August of 2017 when I was 15, right? Um, I, I was looking, right? And I found him right away. Um, and, and I asked the seller to make sure that it was on 3.0. And he's like, yes, I definitely didn't update it. Um, so I was able to find one then, but they're obviously a lot harder to find now. But let's see if maybe, I think there might be one. Um, what's the iPod touch free, iOS free? Um, Most of these are going to be running iOS 5. Um, but this one looks like it might be iOS 4. Yeah. All right, so it's easy to find iOS 4. Um, Um, a third generation ones, even the iPad, um, but they are defined on iOS free. So, okay, that one's iOS four, but that one's a second gen. Um, let's see if I can search iOS free. Three point one point three. Gotta be on there somewhere. Pretty sure I saw one. Maybe it's sold, but um, but yeah, they're really hard to find. Um. But anyway, so this is pretty much um, how you really search um, on eBay for rare devices, whether it's, um, yeah, I'm at 1% battery too, this iPad's going to die in a sec. But pretty much um, what I mean, you do is you go on eBay, of course, you kind of search, um, start off by searching like rare iPad or rare iPhone to see what comes up, see if there's anything good. Rare iPod Touch, sure. Um, to see. Um, and then, if I'm in your I'm looking for a specific model, right? Like, an iPad 2 running iOS 4, or let's say, an iPad 4 running iOS 6, um, or an iPod Touch 4th Gen running iOS 4, or iOS 5, right? Um, or an iPod Touch 3rd Gen and iOS 4, or iOS 3, right? No, those are hard to find. Um, or an iPhone 4, iOS 4, or iOS 5, right? Or, um, 3GS, iOS 4, right? Those are easy to find. Um, or iPhone 5, iOS 6, so something in that nature, right? Pretty much search for it, and they might be pricey. They obviously might not be cheap. They might be a couple hundred dollars, but they're definitely out there. And, um, and it's obviously definitely an investment to have a rare iOS collection because, um, yeah, I'm there, right? Since I definitely have overpaid in the past, but there are some pretty good deals I've gotten on too. Like sometimes you, you, you can score some steals. So, um, um, like an iPhone 4, iOS 4, $60, even, even if it's downgrade, pretty good deal. I mean, yeah, right? Some people will downgrade them and just overprice them. And But I did see a non-downgrade one on there. So, um, but, um, but that's pretty much what, um, that's pretty much how I do it. Um, now there are other advanced ways, um, like, if you can't find one at all, right, what I would do is, then I would just go to Safari and search iPhone 3GS iOS free. So, say, 
you're looking for an iPhone 3GS still running iOS 3 for your collection. You see one on iOS 4, an iOS 5, um, and iOS 6, obviously, but you want one on iOS 3, and there aren't any on eBay, or you can't find any on eBay, then go to Safari, search iPhone 3GS iOS 3, or iPhone 3GS new, and sometimes on maybe there's other selling apps that have I, I, iPhone 3GS listings, and then, um, and then more likely than not, there's still one running iOS 3 on another selling app, um, always possible, so, um, so that's just a quick tip there, um, I hope, um, this video helped, and I might make a part two of this, but until next time, peace out, everybody.